Hello, my name is Paul Richards. I am with PTZ Optics, and today we are looking at the 12X SDI PTZ Optics camera. We're going to go over what comes in the box, all the inputs and outputs, and the general features of this camera. First of all, we, it comes in either gray or white, and um, we'll go over what comes in the box first. It comes with an IR remote control that can control up to four cameras. does all your pan tilting and zooming, all your focus and everything like that. Um, the 50 page, 50 plus page uh, manual here that has everything you might want to know about the camera, uh, your uh, power supply, and then an RS-232 cable you can use to connect to a joystick controller that we offer. So first, let's talk, talk about the, uh, the, the general um, features of this camera. It's a 12x optical zoom with 1080p video up to 30 frames a second. We have HD SDI, HDMI, and IP streaming, and uh, all of those are um, simultaneous, which is great. Uh, for camera control, we have the IR remote, which can control up to four cameras. Uh, we have IP control, which where we can do our open source control software. We've got uh, four ready-made IP controllers. Uh, you can actually set an IP address for this camera and you can um, log right into it, uh, set a static IP address. You can also use our, our ready-made IP controllers for broadcast corporate education or houses of worship and you can customize it for your scenario very easily and just connect to it over any computer or smartphone over that IP address. Um, it also supports OnVIF control over IP, which is security protocol. We have RS-232 and RS-485, which allows for uh, VSCA, PELCO-D, or PELCO-PND um, PND, um, protocols. So when we look at the 12X SDI, we have to talk about the 20X SDI, because they're really the same video outputs uh, with just different uh, lenses on them. So we've got a 72 degree wide field of view with the 12X, which is really ideal for small to medium sized rooms, where you could capture um, you know, everyone sitting at a table, potentially. Um, so it, it actually complements the 12X for, and the 20X, uh, depending on what scenario you have. So when we talk about this, uh, there's a tool on ptzoptics.com called the PTZ Optics Design Tool. And you can use this tool to lay out the fields of view in your room, whether it's a conference room, a training room, or a boardroom, or an auditorium, and lay out the, the different cameras that you plan on using and look at the wide and the narrow field of view and see how it works in your scenario. So that's what I usually say when we're looking, talking about those different cameras. Let's, let's take a look at the difference between the two and see um, you know, what we can do. So now let's take a look at the back of the camera. Uh, as you can see here, we have the ability to do IP streaming. So we can stream directly off this camera. We can do dual streaming, so one 1080p and one SD live stream off of here. We can also control the camera from here and set a static IP address. There's a line in that embeds with the IP stream so you can send video and audio. Um, we've got an HDMI out, and that HDMI uh, is simultaneous with the HD SDI and the IP stream. So that's really great for like a confidence monitor, maybe an HD recorder, where your main stream's coming off of HD SDI to a broadcast switch, and then your IP maybe is streaming some video or controlling your situation. All three are simultaneous. And they're all set by the system select tool right here. So that's how you would select 1080p 30, 720p 30, whatever resolution you want these to come out as. Uh, of course, I mentioned the analog port there. Uh, we have RS-232 in and RS-232 out. What that allows you to do is daisy chain multiple units together and maybe control them with a single joystick controller. Uh, you can actually do up to 256 cameras with our joystick controller that we have. So um, that's really everything. Thank you for watching, and uh, this has been the official camera overview for the PTZ Optics 12X SDI. Thank you.